Electric cars now represent the fastest growing vehicle market around the world, with a broad variety available for every consumer. As a result, most people are already familiar with high performance models like the Tesla Roadster and Audi's e-tron, but what you might not be familiar with is quite how far the technology can be pushed. There's now a number of electric supercars on the market that more than hold up against their petrol counterparts, and you won't believe what's possible. Don't forget to buckle your seatbelts and hold on for a crazy ride as we take a look at 10 all-electric supercars you never knew existed. Before we begin, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, subscribe to Most Extreme, and click the bell icon for notifications. Now, let's get started. Estrema Fulminia First founded in 2020, Estrema has already made waves in the industry with their unique approach to vehicle design. The first vehicle to be announced by the company is a Fulminia, which truly takes EV driving to the next level. The hypercar, which has a four-motor setup that's capable of generating a combined 2,040 horsepower, will be able to accelerate from 0 to 200 miles per hour in less than 10 seconds, something that even the most capable of petrol vehicles will struggle to achieve. It's set to stand out from other electric hypercars because the company says it will have a solid-state battery pack supplied by Avesta Battery Energy Engineering. This special order battery will give the Fulminia 100 kilowatt hours, fast charging capabilities, and 323 miles of range on a full charge. The Fulminia is set to be unveiled by late 2021 and go into full production by 2023, with only 61 exclusive editions planned to be produced. Hongi S9 if you have a need for speed, there's truly nothing quite like the Hongi S9, which is able to reach 60 miles per hour in under 1.9 seconds. Hongi, which is a joint venture between Chinese auto giant Four and Italian design and engineering company Silk EV, are collaborating to create a phenomenal performance hybrid vehicle with a powertrain that can produce the equivalent of 1,381 horsepower. It will have an impressive top speed of 250 miles per hour, and while it's technically a hybrid, it will draw most of its speed and performance from its batteries. The Hongi S9 has already debuted at the Shanghai Auto Show in 2021, and its production design will be overseen by none other than Walter de Silva, former chief of design at Volkswagen, and responsible for the likes of the Audi A5 and Lamborghini Miura concept car. Only 70 cars are expected to be made in celebration of the 70th anniversary of the People's Republic of China, and they're scheduled for rollout in 2022. ArcFox GT When the ArcFox GT debuted at 2021 Geneva Auto Show, it stunned everyone in attendance because of its mesmerizing future look and sleek external finish. The Chinese-made all-electric performance EV is being manufactured by Beijing Automotive Industry Holding Company, which is one of China's top auto manufacturers. The Grand Tourer supercar, designed with an integrated carbon monocoque, generates 1,020 horsepower, which allows it to accelerate from 0 to 60 in 2.5 seconds and reach a top speed of 158 miles per hour. For a hypercar, the GT will be relatively heavy, weighing about 4,000 pounds, a result of the heavy-duty battery pack that was needed to give it a range of 400 miles on a full charge. It features fast charging with an 85 kilowatt battery, taking just 30 minutes to reach an 80% charge. The ArcFox GT is the company's flagship vehicle that reflects the extremes of speed, technology and design, with the only downside being the price. The model, when it's released, is expected to have a price tag of $1.1 million. TechRules 1896 Trev TechRules is a Chinese company that first unveiled a brand new all-electric model called the AT96 Trev at the 2016 Geneva Motor Show. It was a groundbreaking electric supercar concept that made many take notice. Called a turbine recharging electric vehicle, it features exceptionally high performance with an eco-friendly powertrain. The car produces an impressive 1,030 horsepower and is able to accelerate to 60 miles an hour in just 2.5 seconds, with an expected top speed of 217 miles per hour. The AT96 Trev features a lithium manganese oxide battery that's equipped with a new charge balancing strategy that redistributes excess voltage in cells that are charging quickly to amp up those that are falling behind. The vehicle also features a micro gas turbine, just in case the electric storage isn't quite enough, that has a spin of 96,000 RPM and serves as a range extender by generating electricity for charging the car's onboard battery pack. 
This again supplies power to electric motors that drive the vehicle's wheels and means that the best part about this car is that it's projected to cover an astonishing 1,200 miles on less than one gallon of fuel. Hyperion XP1 The Hyperion XP1 is a super attractive car that uses hydrogen for energy storage instead of a battery. With a futuristic spacecraft design that reflects cutting-edge engineering, it's manufactured by California-based Hyperion Motors. Its hydrogen-powered engine should give the XP1 the ability to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.2 seconds, with a single tank of fuel expected to give an incredible range of 1,000 miles. Its carbon-titanium monocoque chassis will certainly have heads turning as you drive through town, and the interior is just as impressive. Using the latest holographic and gesture control technology, it crosses the divide between science fiction and reality in a way that's never been possible before. Expect this to be on the roads by 2022, with pre-orders having already unfortunately sold out. Aston Martin Rapid E The Rapid E is the very first electric car by renowned British manufacturer Aston Martin. Based on the company's Rapid S, it swaps out the V12 engine and replaces it with two rear-mounted electric motors, which produce 602 horsepower. The motors are able to accelerate the vehicle from 0 to 60 miles per hour in around 4 seconds, and it maxes out with a top speed of 155 miles per hour. Instead of the bulky fuel tank, the Rapid E has a 65 kilowatt hour battery pack that gives it a range of up to 200 miles, and despite the fact that it'll take three hours to fully charge the battery, quick charging capabilities mean that you'll have enough power for most mid-distance journeys within 45 minutes. Rimac Nevera Croatian-based manufacturer Rimac set out to create an all-electric car to rival the Tesla Roadster, and has come up with an incredible vehicle called the Nevera. Thanks to its 120 kW 3 elements battery pack, it can reach a top speed of 258 miles per hour and accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 1.8 seconds. Even more impressively, it'll reach 100 miles per hour in 4.3 seconds, making it faster at those low acceleration speeds than a Formula One car is capable of. Offering a power output of 1,914 horsepower, despite weighing 4,740 pounds, the statistics of this car are phenomenal, and to make things even better, it has a 340 mile range on a full charge. When connected to a 500 kilowatt charger, it takes only 19 minutes to recharge the battery from 0 to 80%, which makes it one of the best in class. Remac does, however, only plan to make 150 of these, and starting at $2.4 million, it's targeted at a very specific type of clientele. ArcFox 7 Electric the Arc Fox 7 Electric was designed and developed by BAIC Industries, which took inspiration from Formula E race cars. Created in Spain, it's extremely aerodynamically efficient as a result, but the addition of gold doors and even a fingerprint scanner on the start button shows you that the company has made sure it's incredibly fun to drive too. The Arc Fox 7 is powered by a powerful 6.6 kilowatt battery, connected to a 603 horsepower electric motor underneath its shiny hood. The motors allow it to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in under 3 seconds, and it'll reach a top speed of 162 miles per hour. The Arc Fox 7 can cover a distance of over 185 miles on a full battery, and with the ability to quick charge, or even fully replace the battery with a fully charged one, you can feasibly go on long road trips with one of these. Lotus Ivea Lotus has always prided itself on its ability to manufacture exclusive aspirational cars, and the Ivea is no exception. The car's exterior design is true to form, with its butterfly doors and large rear wing, but what truly makes it stand out is its performance. The Avea comes with four powerful electric motors that can deliver 2,000 horsepower, making it one of the most powerful cars on the planet. It's able to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in under three seconds, and reaches top speeds well over 200 miles per hour. One of the tricks Lotus has used is the inclusion of a single-speed transmission that sends power to all four wheels, so not only is it fast, but it has surprisingly precise and responsive handling. Furthermore, while most electric vehicles can take a long time to recharge, the Avea takes only 12 minutes to fill it to 80%, meaning there's very little difference between it and a petrol car. Amazingly, for a full charge, it takes just 18 minutes, and that's enough to travel 250 miles. Of course, to have the best technology around is expensive, and with only 130 ever made, Avea's went on the market for a cool $2 million. Kiantu K50 the Kiantu K50 was unveiled to the world at the 2019 New York International Auto Show and proved just how competitive the electric supercar market is becoming. 
It features two high-performance motors that generate a combined 430 horsepower, which allows it to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.3 seconds, with a top speed of 125 miles per hour. Fitted with a 78 kilowatt lithium-ion battery, the K50 has a maximum range of around 230 miles, and this can easily be extended because it takes just 45 minutes to get to an 80% charge. Admittedly, some of these statistics aren't as impressive as some of the other electric supercars that you could choose instead, but with an asking price of $115,000, the K50 is undoubtedly the most affordable, high-performance electric vehicle in the world right now. As you can see, the electric supercar market is far more advanced than most people realize, and there's a wide range of vehicles available that aren't just about being good to the environment, but are incredibly fast and fun to drive too. Do you feel like electric hypercars are worth the hype? And which of these ones would you most like to own? Make sure to let us know in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to Most Extreme, and click the bell to get notified of our latest releases. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.